Hey y'all, welcome back to another video on AB Inspire TV. If you are new, you know what to do. Like, comment, and subscribe. So we are all gathered here today for one reason and one reason only. This right here, fam. This is the Miel Rosemary Mint Scalp and Hair Strengthening Oil. And y'all, this product has got all the girlies in a tussle all over the inters of net. Wanting to argue, fighting for their lives back and forth. And of course, you guys know your girl got you. I'm going to be answering two questions for you today. And that is, is this product really worth it? And does this product really make your hair grow the way all the girls are saying on social media? Now I'm going to be leaving a few clips up from last month and this was exactly a month ago today is february 13th and this was january 13th and now i have and now i have this bald spot going on on my scalp <laughs> So as you guys can see, I got a bald patch right in the middle of my head, completely bald. My hair was completely ripped out. It was one of the worst experiences that I ever had. So today I'm actually going to take off my SZA wig. Yeah, y'all, I like to call this my SZA wig because it's like cute and yakky and whatnot. Yeah, she's a different person, I know. But I'm going to be showing you guys the hair growth that I got within the last five weeks. And if you guys want to see details as to what exactly happened with that bald spot, I will go ahead and leave a link down below to that video so you guys can check that out. But let me go ahead and show you guys the one month results. So this right here, as you can see, are my one month results. I will leave a before and after from last month. I don't know if you guys can see that exactly, but I will try to come as close as possible for you guys. So as you can see, it's really, really grown. Look at that. You see there is like a whole patch now right there. There's pretty much some fuzzies actually as well. And you have to think about it, y'all. This is all considering that my hair was completely gone. It was completely bald. I'm talking about my hair was literally pulled from the scalp. I'm talking about like the bulb of my hair was you know when you guys tweeze your hair and you can see the bulb at the end of your hair? Yeah, that's exactly what happened to my hair. So this is what it is looking like now. I am actually very proud of the growth. Can you imagine y'all? Like, look at this. It's giving a quarter of an inch, y'all. She got inches, yes. So I am super duper Uber happy about my results. Look at that. And this again is only a month's worth of growth. So as you guys can see, the product is really, really working the way that it's supposed to. I actually put oil all over my hair as well. So I'm pretty much done with the bottle because I have a very big head and as you guys can see I have a lot of hair as well so so I use this hair oil literally everywhere now I do want to let you guys know that some of the things that I did do to make sure that my hair was growing was I massaged 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 every time I put hair oil on my hair I literally massage for about 10 minutes Y'all, massaging is going to increase your blood circulation, which helps with hair growth. So that is something that I made sure I did. 
I also drink a lot of water. I try to drink about a gallon of water a day. Drinking water will definitely help with hair growth. And also just an FYI, I did not use any other product. The only other product that I did use was the Miel Moisture Hawaiian Ginger Moisturizing Leave-In Conditioner. And I did not use that on my actual scalp. I used it on my hair just for moisturizing. So the only thing that I've been using Using within this month is this Miel Rosemary Mint Scalp and Hair Strengthening Oil, y'all. So, to answer our two questions, does this product work? Obviously. Obviously, I am your spokesperson. I am your spokes girl. This product works. I know sometimes it's hard to get a reach on these products, but y'all, I'm telling you, you can try to get it from Amazon, try going to your local Target, try putting yourself on a notification list so you can grab this product. I definitely highly do recommend this product. It works, period. No ands, ifs, or buts. Two, is it worth it? Obviously, it is worth it for me personally. I know some of the girlies have mentioned that if you can't get your hands on this stuff, you can go ahead and buy rosemary from your local supermarket or your farmer's market. You can boil it with some water, put some olive oil in it, and it works just fine. But for me, as a lazy natural girl, I mean, I ain't doing all that. I'm sorry, I'm going to the store. I'm gonna go get my oil like that. It just is what it is. So I mean, <laughs> it is really up to you, but is it worth it? I think I paid about $10 for this hair oil. Yes, it is worth it. That's just what it is, okay? I hope you guys determine if you guys are going to purchase this product or if you're not. Go ahead and leave a comment down below if you guys already use this and if the hair oil has been working for you, how it's been working, any negatives, positives, what you guys got out of this product. And thank you guys so much again for watching. I love you guys so much and I will see you guys in my next video. Mwah. Bye!